All right, this video is going to be about controls and variables and basically how to set up an experiment. Uh, I think this is uh, something better learned through experience, setting up your own experiments, uh, going through examples uh, that, that might or might not be in class. So this is not going to be very long, uh, but there are some things that I want to say about how to set up an experiment, what controls are and what variables are uh, so that we can get to the science. All right, so variable. If you look at that word, variables, uh, whether it's independent or dependent that you'll learn about, uh, variable is another word for change. Okay, so in both cases, something is changing. Something that can change in an experiment is a variable. There's two types, uh, independent and dependent variables. So we'll learn about those right now. Okay. The independent variable is something that the experimenter changes. Uh, it will affect or, or tr strive to affect the end result. This is the thing that you're trying to figure out if it works. Okay. Uh, the thing added that attempts to fix the problem. Okay. Taking away the light from the plant. If that, your hypothesis was plants don't need light to grow, uh, the independent variable would be the thing the experimenter is changing to try to see if it works to solve the problem or to answer the question that was posed. Uh, the milk to cure the burning tongue. In Ada's case of the hot pepper, uh, the milk itself would be the thing the experimenter is changing. So that is the independent variable. Uh, let's say there is a new drug that is being tested that will cure a uh, common cold. Uh, the giving the test group uh, that new drug that is supposed to work that's being tested that's the independent variable in that case so uh, you can compare that to other things but the independent variable it's the thing you're trying to figure out if it works the dependent variable I always want you to think of it as the thing that the experimenter is measuring okay the thing you measure in the experiment okay Okay, so the dependent variable uh, is something that you observe that changes. It's the thing that you're measuring. It might be affected by the independent variable, um, but I think the what I come back to and what is easiest for most of you, or will be easiest for most of you to remember, the dependent variable is the thing in the experiment that's being measured. Okay, in the, uh, the plant example, you're measuring plant growth. In Ada's hot pepper example, you're measuring how bad the tongue still felt after you have that independent variable uh, being measured here. Uh, the effectiveness of the drug, is the common cold still there uh, or has it been cured? So the thing you're measuring is the dependent variable. All right, here's another way to think of things here. Uh, the independent variable is what I change, starts with an I after all what I change, the thing you're trying to see if it works. The dependent variable is what you observe or measure. All right, last thing here is the control. Uh, the control or the control group is the thing that stays the same in the experiment. It's the part that's going through normal conditions. Uh, to refer back to our examples, the plant that receives a normal amount of sunlight uh, is the control. It's nice to have something con to compare the results of what you're trying to test to what would have actually happened okay under normal conditions it's very important when you're setting up an experiment to have a control a baseline to compare it to um, in the other example of the the, the pill that could uh, cure the common cold uh, it would be the test group that does not receive the new drug uh, it also might be the group that gets the placebo pill uh, placebo is something like a sugar pill uh, that is made or it's given uh, just like the other group just so that you can compare it to something else. It's not theoretically supposed to work but uh, in actuality placebo pills and placebos do uh, quite amazing things uh, so that, that you're, if you, even if your brain thinks you're getting a pill that will make you better just that process of thinking uh, about that actually does improve your condition in a lot of cases. Anyway, the control is the thing that stays the same. 